telling you, because if he touches me, I'm putting him on the floor. You'll come near me, I'll put you lay down on the floor. I'll lay you sleep. I'll put you six feet deep. I'll put you six feet deep. He just told the cop to put him six feet up. Yeah. 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 these universities are now in support of free speech because I know when I go to speak at a college campus yes. yep. that my, my mere presence is labeled hate speech and they say that I shouldn't be there there's protests that even if a conservative shows up on campus to speak but now they're worried about the chilling effect on pro-Palestinian speech a lot of this not just pro-Palestinian speech but obviously anti-Jewish anti-Semitic anti-Israel pro-Hamas so 
you've got the New York Times trying to do all these mental gymnastics to make this seem like it's okay. Clear what side they're on. But I think as you see these admissions or these applications drop, I think these elite universities need to be terrified of the culture they've created. And people are going to, I guess, decide with where they want to go to school. And I hope that they do. Take matters into your own hands. Don't go to these schools. Yeah, look, you know, so we're like 70 days removed from the war in yeah. Israel and Gaza. Uh, but yet we are still, including Bill Maher, having to explain why what the Harvard president couldn't come to terms with accepting that the river to the sea is a call for genocide of the Israeli people.